Welcome back to Nana's Cooking Craft Corner. I'm happy to be back and I'm here to show you on my series of envelope journals. This is my number four journal. They'll either be mixed media, art journals or something like that, but they will be all made through envelopes. So uh, this is the way this one looks particularly. This one I used metal on the corners and um, you have a little bit of a, a metal pheasant which I kind of decorated. I decorated on uh, with the little diamonds you can see the sequences this right here I thought I'd try something new because I'm not used to working with it I had um, my daughter gave me a handkerchief for crafts and so this was a kind of a really pretty handkerchief with a flower on it so I've used a handkerchief on it and it is three levels of you have the main um, envelope then you have uh, printed paper on here and then I have also the napkin and then, of course, um, as you can see, I decorated with some lace and some, uh, some red sequences and a little butterfly, of course. And I used the red, um, the letters are red just to pop the color on it. And I just thought I thought I had something cute since I'm journaling or whatever, a little ink bottle I made out of polymer clay. That's the front of it. And I will show you the back here. Well, I'm going to open this up. Actually, I'm going to open it up and show you the whole thing. So the inside is what I love to do. Ooh, I got a little bit of sequence here. Let's get that out there. Um, what I love to do is gardening, so I just kind of like um, put pictures of botanical pictures, which I um, I did a journal on with botanical, which I really love gardening. And anyways, around here the edges I put um, Wicastella gold, just to kind of like accent the little sparkle part of the frame. Now again, like the others, these are, and some of the journals will be done a little differently, but these ones were made with, um, not mixed media paper, but it was made with um, watercolor paper, that's what I want to say. And, and if I can move you over, right, this was just a little simple, another picture. Of course, uh, everybody that knows me is I'm connected with the Raising monarch Butterflies, Monarch Butterflies, I mean. So you'll always see normally a touch of butterfly somewhere on everything I make normally. And, and here's some little, um, what are called hessian flowers. Um, yeah, like uh, whatever potato sack is, uh, little flowers. And I'm going to turn you to the back. And I was saving for this moment to show you my charm after because I designed this on one of my friends. Uh, love and light means, you know, the love for each other and with the world being the way it is, we all need to love each other. And the light is for God to, to shine through us, for all to heal and get through all this time. And of course, angels represent, they're down on earth here to represent for God. So that was my creation and my thoughts when I did it. I always have an idea how I want to design a journal. And here it is. So I'm going to say right here, if you want to know how to make these beads, I did this on a live stream earlier. But this is what I was telling them. They did that. Um, I put, I want to know what represents love is hearts. So I did all these polymer clay hearts on my little charm here. And of course the light represents God and there's the candle representing the light. And of course crystals is always a positive thing to attach to it. So this is how I designed this one. And uh, please look forward to the next one I do. I am starting up my next envelope journal as we speak. So thank you for watching. I'll speak to you soon. Have a great day. Bye from Nana.